Hello guys, what's up? I've got a video here for Call of Duty Ghosts. I've got some Call of Duty Ghost squad gameplay going here. So basically, uh, the mode where you use your soldiers that you've created, and um, you've created the classes for them, you've ranked them up, um, in normal multiplayer or in squads mode, I believe, and then you take your soldiers into battle and v someone else's squad. Or you can work with someone, you can have multiple people playing in your squad, whatever. But at the moment, as this was on the, uh, I think the second day of the game being out, uh, everyone's uh, soldiers were quite low levels, and most people, uh, these two I've played against, only had the one soldier that they had been ranking up, whereas I had two, but uh, one was like a stealth ghost, and one was the one I normally play as. So I had a slight advantage there, because I started trying to rank up two soldiers, but obviously this means it's going to take longer to rank up. But yeah, so I wanted to discuss, um, obviously now we've got um, more sort of different types of primary guns than we've had before. Uh, so I wanted to discuss what is the best uh, primary gun class in Call of Duty Ghosts. Because obviously uh, in Black Ops 2 the SMGs were, oh my god, they were so powerful, it was unreal. And it did sort of um, make it that you, you know... You didn't really need to use the other classes. Obviously, the LMGs were uh, buffed up a lot. Um, the sniper rifles, they were sort of, you know, built for quick scoping. Let's face it. I mean, like they were barely usable as normal snipers anymore because, like the Treyarch maps, they're not designed for sniping. That's not how they roll. But yes, yeah, so uh, in uh, Call of Duty Ghost. Oh, the main thing I want to talk about is the fact that they've separated the semi-automatic rifles from the assault rifles class. So before we had the FN Fowl, the MK14, it was all kept in the uh, assault uh, rifles class. But now we've got it separately. So um, now we sort of, uh, even though there are less guns in the assault rifle class, there's more uh, semi-automatic rifles uh, that aren't sniper rifles in a totally different class. So um, I want to talk about these because these, I was using them now as you can see in these videos, I uh, bought this one semi-automatic rifle and I'd, I'd practiced a couple matches using these in uh, offline because you get all the guns then. And I was practicing it and oh my god this gun, it is through the roof, it's so good. It's a, um, a uh, semi-automatic rifle marksman rifle that's what it's called almost forgot uh, yes yeah, so it is just the power of this gun is blinding it's really so good i can't believe how like especially if you've got a fast trigger finger you can literally just spam it and then you end up you know taking everyone out i believe it's called the mr28 uh Correct me if that's wrong, but I'm pretty sure that is what it is called. And honestly, it comes with the scope by default, which is actually kind of good. Um, and yeah, it's just, as you can see in the gameplay, reloads fast, huge ammo capacity, the clips are big, short reload time. Obviously, the scope, it's, it zooms in, but it's not like so far that you can't see what you're doing. It's very clear because obviously it's designed like a sniper scope. There's like no recoil. I'm using this with no attachments right here. And, oh my god, it is freaking amazing. So you've got to try this out, guys. I recommend doing it in squads like I was doing here first, as that's easier because you're against, uh, well, obviously the other team has bots on their team. Don't get me the wrong, the bots can be pretty damn good. Um, and obviously they're supposedly meant to like adjust to how well you're playing now. I'm not exactly sure how that's working out, but I have noticed that uh, you will, like, when I'm playing against bots, you can find, like, uh, especially, it was funny on free fall as well because obviously that map is like, pro it is like the only small map on this game where it's um closed in and close quarter. And there's this guy with a sniper rifle just crouched, sitting at the very very back of the map, just looking at a load of walls at his end of the spawn. It's so funny. So yeah, it didn't really work out. They should have thought about that a bit better. But yeah, so um they do uh, have like you know the snipers hanging back and things like that and the SMG guys running and gunning but um yeah try out this marksman rifle guys it is absolutely beast the assault rifles are well they're good I believe uh, later on you will see me using an assault rifle 
as well as the MK. Uh, but honestly, guys, this marksman rifle is beast. The others are okay, but honestly, this is better. Sniping is actually quite a bit harder than I thought it'd be. I've been trying it, not really loving it, but uh, I think it might just be a matter of time of trying to adjust to the new uh, the new rifles and how they work, because obviously it looks a lot different. And something I did notice, for those of you who don't know, there are no crosshairs uh, on snipers in Call of Duty Ghosts, seriously. I, was playing, I mean, maybe I'm just going blind, but I could not see the crosshairs for my life. I don't think they could be so wide they're off the screen, because that's retarded. But I don't know how steady aim's going to work with this, or no scoping or anything. Because even quick scoping's harder now, because you can't really see even roughly where you're going to be aiming in. So it does make it a lot harder, but this is kind of good, because it forces you to be aimed in most of the time, which means classic sniping is going to hopefully come back into play. So that should be a lot better. Yeah, thankfully these two guys I was playing against were pretty awful. <laughs> you can see at the end of the game on the leaderboards on the enemy team, the one that's ranked up, I'm pretty sure that's the one they're playing as. Um, so yeah, uh, the first guy I was playing against was pretty dreadful. But yeah, in both matches I think I went 13-6 or something. I think in both of them, I'm not sure. But yeah, so I'll, I'll leave up the gameplay. There's two videos, guys. If you want to watch them both, that's good. Uh, but basically, it's just me using mainly the MK. Uh, was it, did we decide it was called that? The MK28. MK. Oh, MR28. My bad. MR28. Um. Yes. Yeah, so try out this gun, guys. Uh, and I hope you enjoy it. And I'll bring you another video soon. Maybe some best class videos, more extinction videos. And I'll see you later. Peace. Team Deathmatch. Time to work, Ghost Squad.
this fight! SATCOM ready. SATCOM up and go. Available. Friend and Griffin inbound. destroyed. Good job. Report to command for debrief.